All right, we're a couple Nebraska fans going to our first OU spring game. I've never been into the stadium, so we're going to check it out and see if we like it or not. See if it's better than Nebraska Stadium. We will see. Yep, typical Oklahoma road repair. Ugh. All right, I just arrived here on OU's campus. Got to go meet my son, pick him up. So we can head to that stadium I see up ahead. I wonder how crowded it's going to be. Looks like there's some uh, construction or they're building That's something right there. Field. Softball field? Mm -hmm. Cool. Stoplights. I believe this is Barry Switzer's house. Come out. Kind of a modest looking house. It's not bad. Oh, the car behind me. I got to go. All right. Well, we made it. We're going to go inside and check it out. Crowd's kind of decent. It's still kind of early though. Um, oh yeah, that's really cool. I'm going to go over there and check it out. Yeah, outside of the stadium. How are you recording? Yeah, I'm recording. Here's the Heisman Trophy. Or Heisman, yeah, Heisman Trophy winners here. Yeah, I guess they're in like a statue of... Uh, each one. Now, that's something I wish Nebraska would do. I don't think they've done that. I know they haven't done that. Say so we go to Nebraska game once a year, and then I've been to only one spring game in Nebraska, but it's just really cool. I think they just, uh, the wind's probably going to be blowing. The Kyler Murray's uh, statue was uh, presented today, and I missed it. Damn. Super cool. Alright, fix and see what this stadium looks like. So far, not bad, not bad. Alright, alright, OU. Show me what you got, OU. Let's see. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Man, I haven't been here since freshman year. Not bad. A lot of history played on that field right there. Right there? Hey, it's a, it's almost... What's that? Right there is where we're on uh, the old coach. So I gave his speech. All right, uh, my son, uh, go ahead and just tell him. So right there, that's where uh, Lincoln Riley gave his old speech to us students right there. And uh, his speech was about not giving up and not quitting. How ironic! Okay, I gotta say, it's got a similar layout, Lincoln, but you know, it's it's a, it's a pretty nice stadium, I guess. Yeah, I'm kind of liking it. Oh, yeah, I don't know if you be able to hear me. This is pretty windy. And it's cold. That's not a it's it's a pretty nice stadium. I like it I guess. It's got a nice layout. It's got a lot of like I said history earlier, there's that little brick wall. There's a little brick walls here. That thing's been there for a while, I think. Never been here, but I was here. <laughs> I've never been here. It's really nice. 
Okay, the one thing I do notice, and I, I can't believe I didn't notice it before, this. I can zoom in. I mean, didn't that just used to, uh, I think that used to be o, just an OU in the middle of the field. I don't I know. It is a big, ugly block. Yeah, I don't know if I like that. That looks, that's kind of ugly. I'm, almost, I'm just going to be honest. It's kind of ugly. They should have just, they should have they should have just left the OU. It's loud here. But, um... They could give it a red outline, I guess. Yeah, it's just, maybe it's because it's sloppy, maybe? You can kind of see the OU. Like yeah, I think it's it's natural grass, I, I do believe, still, isn't it? What? No, it shouldn't be, is it? It's not turf. I think it's actual grass. Hey, you know if the field's grass or turf? It's grass. Yeah, I thought it was grass. What? Yeah, I think it is actual grass, so... Why? Well, never mind. I can't say it's ugly if it's actual grass. I think it is. Oh, look, you can see some dirt. Zoom in. There we go. There we go. I think it's one of the few stadiums. I mean, it's not a money issue because we have a big all other field that's all turf. Yeah, I think it's, uh, I don't know, it's one of the few stadiums that has uh, natural turf that's cool okay i take it back i mean yeah it's big and ugly but <laughs> oh, we uh, but well no i mean okay I, i'm not taking it back it does look ugly uh, ugly you know look at the it's just a big red blob or a mar or maroon or crimson blob in the middle of the field they should have just left the ou um i guess it's different Okay, it's cold up there, so I'm going down here. It's really not that cold. I think the high is supposed to be like 60. But right now, it's not 60. It's pretty much a sit where you want, I guess. I mean, I know in Nebraska, we had to sit in our seats. But, uh, like I said, I've only been to one spring game. I go to a an actual game once a year. But I guess the band sits here, all the band members. I'm gonna see how close I can get to the field. All right, this is the underbelly of the stadium. I guess you wanna get your snacks and drinks. This is not bad looking. I really like this. It's like one big hallway, but I'm sure during a game, these suckers are going to be full. This looks like this Oh, does it? Uh, Isn't it indoor? We'll go to the other side and take a look. All right, went with the souvenir popcorn bucket, which is kind of cool. Let me take a look at it. It's pretty awesome. I wish Nebraska would do something like that, which they don't. Here's that. And here's one thing I've noticed souvenir cup which is pretty cool you know i'll look at it better here i don't know if you can see it it's all blurry but here look lids nebraska lids we need lids on our drinks nebraska here you go oh. Oh. all righty okay here's a better look at that cup set my big old fat thumbs in the way No, Nebraska's got some cool cups, but they don't really change them anymore. It used to be fun getting cups, you know, but they're all kind of the same. Maybe they'll spend a little money on our merchandise in the stadium. Oh yeah, and they don't take cash here at the stadium. What is up with that? Okay, I did notice this too, which is pretty clever. Barcode. I guess to uh, I guess to scan your uh, make your t or to make sure that's your seat. Maybe I don't know. That's interesting. I like that. Correction. We scanned it. That just brings you to a website for some ads or something. Getting a little practice in there. I don't. Trying to talk over this music, but I don't think it matters. 
It doesn't matter. Okay, I'm sitting over here in the student section with my son. Sitting next to this little tunnel. I want to say that's pretty old. You can just tell by looking at it. Like I said, man, this uh, stadium's got a lot of history. They probably, you know, they modernize it. Um, I know Nebraska, instead of tearing it down for the most part, it seems like they build around it and they kind of keep it somewhere into the newer structures. They have the older structures. Um, I don't know. I, I don't know. Looks like they uh, are taking the field now to do the warm up. That sounded super serious. Still loading up. Can your mic even take this up? Let's find out. Yeah, I don't know. It's getting a little more full. We got 24 minutes until they kick off.
I think I'm gonna get me this hat. Yeah. Baker Mayfield, Billy Sims, Steve Owens, Billy Vessels, Jason White, <laughs> Sam Bradford, Kyler Murray. He got quieter as soon as he got close to people. Who? Huh? Well. That's gonna do it for the spring game. Hmm, did I like it? I grew up watching OU Nebraska play in the Big A and in the Big 12. My family was divided. OU Nebraska. That's my grandpa trying to put a Nebraska hat on my uncle who is a Sooner fan. There was a lot of yelling and cussing during these games. Anyway, back to the spring game. So what did I like about the spring game at OU? Let's see. I love I love the tradition. Um, lids, lids on cups. You know how many bugs and just random debris would land into my drink by the time the second quarter rolled around in Nebraska. It's nasty. I also really liked how they interacted with the fans. You really got the feel that fans were a part of that program and very important to the team. This person's having a great time. I really thought the Heisman statues were awesome. There's only a, really a few things I didn't really like about the stadium. I didn't like it. They didn't, ta they didn't accept any cash. It's cashless. I don't know how long that's been going on, but I didn't like that at all. The stadium did look like it needed repairs in some spots, but wasn't too bad. Overall, I had a good time. The stadium was uh, rich with history. It uh, You felt... A certain energy when you went into the stadium. The fans, um, the players, the coaches, everything was just energetic. And uh, it made me miss the days of the Big 8 and the Big 12 when Nebraska and OU you know, got together. It just felt like football then. But overall, I, I really liked it.